Hey everybody, Chris here. In this video, we're going to be talking about Elon Musk and Dogecoin and was he really running a pyramid scheme? Pump and dump? Elon, would he do that? Nice to see green in the market this morning. We had a big pump, Bitcoin uh, surging more than 8% this morning, uh, bringing up the entire cryptocurrency market with it. Good to see green in the market after a lot of red days. Will it hold? We shall see, and we'll talk about that more in a little bit. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, hit that little notification bell so you can be notified when I make new videos as well as when I go live, live streams every Monday night and Friday night around 8 o'clock Eastern Time, United States Time. I'm in Boston, so uh, that is East Coast Time. So come join. Uh, we'll chat about what's going on in the crypto market. We'll do some Q&A as well. It will be fun. So what is going on with Elon Musk in this lawsuit? It's like, oh my gosh, unbelievable. $258 billion lawsuit against Elon Musk with uh, a bunch of co-defendants now uh, in this case, not only Tesla, SpaceX, the Boring Company, but now we're talking the Dogecoin Foundation, Billy Marcus and Jackson Palmer all involved. It's getting to be quite huge. What is going on? Let's go ahead. Let's take a look at the charts and the news and I'll show you what I'm looking at. So we'll start by looking at the Bitcoin chart here this morning. Uh, Bitcoin was trading yesterday 19,300 and just before that it was like 18,900 and then uh, late last night early this morning Bitcoin takes off up to 21,000. So that's like a 10% gain that we saw there with Bitcoin, a big run in Bitcoin. And what this does is on the Bitcoin dominance, Bitcoin dominance was below 39% and it has pumped up over 40% on Bitcoin dominance. So this is a Bitcoin move that's happening, not so much in a lot of other uh, uh, coins. They're taking their time. Ethereum did uh, come up over 1700, but it didn't have the big pump that Bitcoin had. Dogecoin, Dogecoin trading very well, had been right around six cents here. It bounced off the six cent support line a few times, but then a big run came up and touched six and a half cents. Now it's 6.4 cents trading. So that's good for Doge. So what is going on with this Elon Musk uh, lawsuit? So here at Fox Business, so this is mainstream $258 billion lawsuit that was actually filed back in June. But now there have been additional plaintiffs that have at, been added as well as defendants. So the, the lawsuit is, is uh, growing in terms of its scope. Uh, but here it is, Fox Business News, and here's uh, also on Reuters. So this is this is uh, worldwide. This this Dogecoin lawsuit is out there. So what's going on with it? Uh, Elon Musk Dogecoin lawsuit heats up with new parties joining. First filed in June by New England Electress and Keith Johnson, the lawsuit has added seven new plaintiffs, all investors who lost money in Dogecoin. And there are now six new defendants. Uh, summonses in the civil action case were sent to Musk and other defendants on Wednesday. New defendants include Musk's tunnel construction business company, the, the Boring Company, the Dogecoin Foundation. Other defendants in the case include various developers of Dogecoin, online influencers who pushed the digital asset, and Billy Marcus and Jackson Palmer, the software developers who founded Dogecoin. Um, I don't know who these uh, influencers are who push the digital asset. Um, I, I haven't seen any names of who they are. Uh, I certainly wasn't named in this, so I don't know who this is. Uh, but to have Tesla, uh, SpaceX, uh, and the Boring Company, I mean, because they're accepting Dogecoin as payment for rides in their, in their Las Vegas tunnel, um, that makes this uh, a pyramid scheme or a pump and dump? I don't know. I don't know about this. The suit alleges that defendants drove up the price of Dogecoin more than 36,000% over two years and then let it crash, walking away with tens of 
billions of dollars at the expense of other investors. Oh, unbelievable. So let's take a look at this in more detail. This is the Bitcoinist. Uh, this is very interesting. Uh, the Dogecoin lawsuit against the world's richest man, Elon Musk, accused of running a crypto pyramid scheme, racketeering nearly $258 billion of the investor's money, has expanded. Seven new plaintiffs, six defendants. This is Keith Johnson again. He allegedly he alleges that they intentionally drove up the price of Dogecoin. This is Musk with Tesla and SpaceX, filed in a federal court in Manhattan intentionally drove up the price of Dogecoin thousands of percent and then let it crash. What's interesting about this is that all the, all the new plaintiffs that have joined this together with Keith Johnson all lost money investing in Dogecoin. And what is, what's amazing here is, you know, why $258 billion? Well, this is, Keith Johnson, the initial filer of the case, has claimed to have lost over $86 billion by investing in Musk's project. Like it's like Elon Musk owns Dogecoin and he's seeking triple damages. $86 billion in losses. Now, who would, who would invest that much money into a cryptocurrency, much, much less one that was created as a joke, which is out. I mean, that's <laughs> unbelievable. $86 million. Oh. The defendant also wants judges to declare Dogecoin trading gambling under the law and demands a legal restriction imposed on Musk and his companies to not promote the crypto project with overhyped marketing. He points to the Dogecoin sell-offs of May 2021 in the complaint and linked it with Musk becoming Lloyd Ostertag to host a Saturday Night Live show on NBC. <sighs> We've talked about this on many videos. What happened? Dogecoin was already being shorted by Barry Silbert before the Saturday Night Live show even started. So how, how all of this becomes a pyramid scheme for, for, uh, for Elon Musk, I have no idea. If we, look at, if we look at the chart for Dogecoin, we go to the weekly. So here's Dogecoin. Dogecoin traded up to... 74 cents and that was actually before the saturday night live show it was already going down and being shorted before that show but yes this is this is a bear market guys not only dogecoin has this i mean look at litecoin which isn't even mentioned litecoin was up to 412 dollars a coin now at about 60 dollars a coin we've got Harmony One, Harmony One has traded upwards of 38 cents, and now it's just about two cents. This is what happens in a, a bear market. Here's Crow, Kronos, up to almost a dollar, now at 12 cents. This is a bear market. This is what happens. All cryptos are down. It isn't just Doge. Uh, yes, it hurts to see Doge like this, but but it, 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 it's that this is what happens in them and you look at market cycles in the past um you know, particularly with bitcoin and and you look back at bitcoin's history and you you can see what happened december of of uh of of 2017 when bitcoin hit twenty thousand dollars and then what happens people are selling it's getting shorted and it goes all the way down to three thousand dollars that's what happens. And that, then Bitcoin went up to 69,000, came all the way down to 17 in this bear market. So that gives you the context of, of, of what this lawsuit uh, is about and uh, who's involved. Uh, I, I hope this doesn't drag on, but, but this is what's being done. <laughs> A whole pyramid scheme devised by Elon Musk for Dogecoin. So looking forward and how this applies to Dogecoin, it's not good. Anytime you see lawsuit and Dogecoin and Elon Musk all together, not really good for Doge. 
uh, hopefully this thing is just uh, just a frivolous lawsuit that can be put behind and everyone can move on. But some people are looking for a money grab, cash grab. That's what these guys are doing. I, I suppose they're trying to get what they can. But come on, it's ridiculous, in my opinion, what they're trying to do. And hopefully it can be uh, resolved soon and we can all go on. But Dogecoin's going to have to weather this storm here a little bit. Uh, and then we can prepare for the eventual bull market that's going to come. And then Dogecoin will rise with everything else. And it's not a pump and dump. It's just a, a cryptocurrency with utility as a currency and everyone will see that and doge will be just fine at least that's the plan hope that works let me know in the comments below what you think is elon really running a pyramid scheme is this a pump and dump or is this just another joke give the video a like if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel i appreciate the support we'll see you next time